I will I will definitely be trying to like censor myself so you don't have to like beep things. I've never I haven't beeped a goddamn thing on this. Okay, cool. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dan Umpton, Batman enthusiast and comic book nerd, and I'm speaking with my friend Sarah Streggy, who is a cosplayer and comic enthusiast as well, um, best known probably for your cosplay of... Harley Quinn! When you cosplay as Harley, do you ever get like the male nerd thing of like, oh, I bet you don't know anything about Harley oh, Quinn. Oh, people trying to call me out as a fake geek girl. I've had that when I'm not cosplaying as Harley. I, I own a lot of Harley Quinn shirts and stuff. I mean, um, just Harley Quinn comics, probably like 50 plus. <laughs> like nobody ever <laughs> approaches me and is just like, like, what do you really know about Dr. Doom? Like nobody ever, like there's no qualifier for men. There shouldn't be any qualifier for anybody. There, you, there shouldn't be, but apparently it's this thing where the comic realm or the nerd realm is a guy's only realm, and so women have to prove themselves to be included in it. Like, I've had people who have tried yeah. to out-nerd me when it comes to Harley, and I've called them on their shit. The guy who was installing our internet last year at the place we were living, he was like, so, did you ever read the Harley comics? before the animated series? Uh, no, because Harley Quinn was introduced in the animated series, so she didn't exist prior to the 90s. I'm trying to throw shade on your Harley Quinn knowledge game. What a turd. When I was at C2E2 one year, I saw a woman dressed as Psylocke. It, it was the classic Chris Claremont. This other guy was standing like right next to me, and as soon as I was done snapping the picture, he's like, so, like, have you even read Uncanny X-Men, like, during Chris Claremont's run? Anyway, Ugh. they're making your con better by being dressed up. Why are you questioning them? Well, and there shouldn't even have to be, like, a qualifier at all. You don't have to know shit about a character to cosplay. You cared enough about it to make a costume. Exactly! <laughs> I mean, she'd be allowed to do the same and not have to have... Everything that we know just, you know, do you know this comic? Well, what about this issue? What about this specific sentence on this one page? We, that, we need to do this. At Midwest Comic Con, we need to go around with a microphone and approach guys and just be like, so, like, are you really that into Batman, bro? 